All right, part two. Let's go. Um, I think I'm going a little slow because you got part three parts. I'm not even done with the first stack yet. <sighs> Fangren Marauder. Rawr, rawr. Master's Call. A quarter paladin. Need that. For example, that mother. In fact, at the beginning of your upkeep, you get a poison counter. I mean, it's sort of like a pro and a con. Oh, and a foil. Bladed Sentinel. Eh. First thing on Batmother, I mean, if you get it out, he's pretty aggressive. Just keep swinging with him. If it dies, you won't get a poison counter. If it doesn't die, you'll be killing his creatures or making them really weenie. Haha, <laughs> weenie. Rally the Forces. Tangle Mantis. Hexplit Golem. Titan Shrike. Beard and Claw. That's not bad for a. Uh, Equipping for one. Hellkite Igniter. For you, dragon lovers. Seven mana flying haste. One in a mountain. Hellkite Igniter gets plus X plus zero until the end of turn where X is a number of artifacts. You go. Oh, dang. I don't know. For seven mana, I think I can play something a little better. But, you know, some people like dragons and they have dragon decks. That's fine. I also have a dragon deck, but it's pretty crappy because I made it like three, four years ago. Tangle Manus. Sometimes you guys are like, get to the cards when we see the good ones. I'll do it at like the second half. I just like zoom through all this. Mirror works. Or another non token artifact is a battlefield under your control. You may pay two if you do put a token that's a copy of that artifact onto the battlefield. Not bad. Pay two. So it could be like, this mirror works next turn. Um, or next few turns. Worm call. Oh, tap two. I copy it. You know. Phyrexian Crusader. Oh, only if I was a Mirror and Crusader. I, I need that more. But I can probably trade this off and get some get a Mirror and Crusader. Alright. Oh Oculus. Foil. Swamp. Poison counter. Contested War Zone. Whenever a creature deals combat damage to you, then that creature gains control. Oh. Hmm. I don't know how that's going to work. Uh, over there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Since I drew, uh, since I had a uh, Doctor Assembly in the pre release, I was ahead. Uh, Treasure Maze, man, that helped me big time. I just searched for that sucker. Every time I got him out, I was like, you know what I'm going to get. Same card, Thopter Assembly. Oh, first Mythic, Massacre Worm. Uh, he's not bad. He's not, not bad at all. Oh, a Quarter Paladin. Signal Pest. There is a, there's a really good Signal Pest deck out there with, uh, with some... Uh, Goblin guys and some, well, just cheap and fast, heavy hitting goblins. Really, you can destroy your opponent with some teetering peaks in there too. Island trading card. Galvanoth. If you're up to, you may look at the top card of your library. If it's an instant or sorcery card, you may cast it without paying its mana cost. Uh -uh. Hero of Bladehold. Sweet. That's what I needed to complete my night deck. Well, the Hero of Bladehold part of the night deck. Because now I got four. So I got three pre release promos, and now I got one regular. Tight. Oh, foil blister stick shaman. Come in to play, deal one damage to creature or player. Red Sun Zenith. 
Uh, oh, wrong pile. Is this it? Yeah, this is. So now all I'm missing is the black Sun Zenith and the. I think that's it. Just the black. Red, blue, green, white. Yeah, just the black. Oh, foil black sun zenith, sweet man. I was just just a minute ago. I was like, man, all I need is a black one, and he gave me a foil one. Oh man, that that that. Oh man, I'm speechless. Planes. Another black sun zenith. Wow, a foil black sun zenith and a regular black sun zenith in the same pack. Oh dang. Pretty sure other people have pulled like much better cards. Like I don't know, I'm just guessing right now. A foil Karn, I mean not Karn. Oh wow, a uh, foil cough and a and a regular. Uh... Wow, Venser, there you go. But you know, oh well, I'm not that lucky. But it'd be nice to get a Tezzeret. Forced. Germ. Mirren Crusader, yay son. What's over here? Another good card is this Sphere of the Suns. Man, that is... I like that card. It helps you get your mana fixed. Just by tapping and removing a counter. So pretty much each turn you have like an extra mana. So it's a 6 drop would be a 5 drop. You know. Messy guy. Island. What was that? Zombie token. A green sun zenith. Wow, this is like a, zen a zenith box. It's pulling it out of the pack. Alright, more. Less than half to go. Yeah. Mountain. Poison counter. Contested war zone. Another one. Signal pest. Signal pest. Oh, Sky Hunter. Yeah. Oh, Tarn Shrike. 2 1 flying infect. I don't know about that. Swamp. Germ. Mirror Waller. Turn artifact card is all activate ability. Hmm. It's helpful in some way. Right now I can't think of it. Kemba's Legion? Vigilance 4 6 block as many creatures if it for as many like equipment it has or something. Block and another another for each equipment. Okay. I don't know. I think that's a seven drop, a six drop, something around there. A little pricey. Uh, forced token Titan Forge yay three tap put a charge counter on Titan Forge remove th tap remove three charge counters and put a nine nine colorless golem artifact onto the battlefield dang if that can like if that car can take off you win pretty much even with Infect, I'd still destroy the Infect card and he'd like be like a 5-5, which is still like a monster card, you know? Dang, Titan Forge. Foil Unnatural Predation. Plus one, plus one, Trample. Spine of Ishsa. That's just a weird card. Uh, for a 7 drop? I don't know about that. All right. Oh, it's nine minutes. Um, cliffhanger, part three. That way.